What is up you guys? Today I'm going to do a product review. I am not paid by them. I have no ties with them. Hopefully they'll see this and enjoy it. But this is mainly for you guys. If you have seen, everybody knows that Crocs are very famous uh, sneakers, slip-ons, whatever you want to call them. Uh, sandals, all that. But they make a shoe. And every time I show people these, they can't believe that Croc makes a shoe. Crocs are very comfortable. That's why people wear them. That's why they're so popular. But you take that technology and you add it to a tennis shoe, it changes the game. And I didn't realize that until a friend of mine, uh, Stephen, if you watch this, um, shout out to you because you, you've changed everything for me. Um, I went and he, he talked about these. He posted these on Facebook. And so I had to go get me a pair. And so I did. These are the Croc light ride tennis shoes for for men they make them for women as well and these shoes are incredible i bought these on christmas um of 2021 it's 2022 now it's may it's been five months and you're going to get to see these shoes they've held up really well however i do want you to understand that i have wore these practically every single day since christmas Literally, have I not, Kenley? No. I wear these every day, don't I? Yeah. Every day. Like, I wear every, these shoes every like day. Every day we go to school. Every day. All right. So, I've worn these shoes every single day, and I wear them not just casually, but I wear these at the gym. I wear these, uh, I've worn these playing basketball. I've worn these a lot. And shopping. And, 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 and the five months, and almost church. six months that I've had them. Church, shopping, everything. So anyways, let, let me continue this. So as you can see, they're still in great shape. These are the white ones. So I will say I've cleaned them a lot. You can tell they look good to be that old, but I clean them like every, every week a couple times. So as you can see, there's a blue hue coming up in, in, in the white here. Um, that's just from where they've been worn a lot. You can tell that. You can see where I've, you know, the, the strings are getting a little bit worn. Um, and so you can see the bottom of them. Actually, it's still very good. I'm a big guy. I'm 250 pounds. <laughs> and so this bottom actually looks incredible. That right there is where the uh, soles of my feet are. I walk on the treadmill in these just about every day. Since um, December... Christmas, these things have walked a uh, many miles because I walk on the treadmill every single day, pretty much. Um, and I've played basketball on concrete with these shoes. And as you can tell, they have held up amazing. So what I've done, I like them so much. What I've done is I've ordered a new pair. I'm going to take these and leave them at my locker at the gym. These are going to be my gym shoes. I like them that much. I've never wore a shoe that felt better than these on the treadmill. Like I can walk forever on the treadmill. And since they're made out of that rubber crop material, I mean, look at them, they have no creases. They still look great. Um, they've held up tremendously. They're dirtier right now than they have been in a while. So, um, I mean, these things are insane. They will withstand a beating. Be. Yeah, and they're very comfortable just like Crocs. So with that being said, I'm taking these to the gym. This is the Croc Light Ride. So with that being said, um, I have, all right, stop for a minute. Just chill for a minute. Um, so I went to order, I was going to order some of these and I found them on Amazon and stuff and they have them on sale. But I noticed on the Croc site that they have, they're discontinuing this one and, or I say discontinuing, it's not up there for sale right now. And they had this one. This one is the uh, Light Ride 360. It's the new version. So what I'm going to do, I just got these in the mail today and I've, I've already put them on and they're pretty comfortable. Um, just like these. So what I want to do is I want to show you a little bit of the differences. Okay. So one thing we'll, we'll just get two of the same shoe yeah. here. Let's do this. All right. So one thing is that, as you can see, these have got holes and these are kind of more of like an oval design, pretty much the same thing. However, I will say these feel a little bit thinner than these. These are a little bit thicker. This shoe, they're pretty much the same weight, I would say. Um, little bit different design altogether. Like if you look at the side here, these have more of an arch where these are more flat on the bottom. 
Um, which when you're wearing them, you can't tell either way. Um, then you, you, you see the sole here, how that looks. You see that. Um, it's just, it's a little bit different design. There's the shoe that way. As you can see, it's a different design a little bit. This comes up here. Now, the both shoes look incredible. These have the little thing here. It says light on one and right on the other, which is cool. You could probably take that off if you didn't want it. Yeah, yeah it clips off. I don't care. I'll leave it up there. Yeah, see, light ride. It says light ride. But here's the deal. Here's some of the differences. Um, for one, the tongue. This actually has a tongue, a regular like shoe tongue. This one doesn't. It's made into the shoe, and it's like a slip-on shoe kind of. Now, I've put I've put it on. I've put these on, and I'll say I like this one better. I like this better. It slips on so much better because it stretches out, it slides on, and then you can snug it up. There's no problem with this. I've never had a problem putting this on. I just this slip my foot slid into this one much simpler, I guess, than it did this one. I don't know. My foot doesn't go, it's not hard to put on. Um that's one of the differences though, is it like the tongue is made in, it's made of a little bit different material um, on this. Also, you can see where it laces, it goes in and over like that. And this one laces like that. Um, so that's one That's one other difference. Um, as far as the inside, they're pretty much the exact same. Uh, as you can see, you probably see the, the, the little rib things on the bottom of your feet in this one are different than this one. Um, this one, they're a little bigger. This one, they're a little bit smaller. Um, and so anyways, that's the main differences in the two. As you can see the sole there, maybe they've done something to upgrade that a little bit. It looks like it actually may be a little bit different material. It looks like this right here may be your typical crop material, maybe this, and then this is over it to maybe strengthen it, make it last longer. It does feel, this sole feels like it's a lot, maybe a little bit stiffer, um, probably a stronger sole than this one. But I haven't hadn't hadn't had an issue out of this one, so um, that's your main differences. Like I said, I have put these on; they do feel somewhat different, but not different. They feel like the the the, the light ride. So if you have these and you're debating on getting these, I would say it's definitely worth it. These are nice. Um, they just you know, like I said, they haven't been out that long. Um, such a great shoe, the Croc Light Ride. Uh, they have different colors in these and these. Now, you can still get these on Amazon. These are my gym shoe. This is my everyday shoe. I put these on every single day, and I will continue with these. These are going my uh, locker at the gym. Uh, so after five months of use every day, playing basketball, walking on the treadmill, I love them so much I had to buy a pair for everyday use and I'm taking these to the gym and still will be using these every day. So anyways, thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions concerning these shoes, please let me know in the comment section below. And uh, don't forget, like, subscribe, share, and comment. And combinations and give us a thumbs up. All right, Bye. see ya.